Uh, it started well, with well, Michael McCann. Yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and start. Hey, Sydney, this is uh, Matt McCann from Sports Illustrated. Um, how has it been uh, since you got to campus, you know, adjusting to practice, and adjusting to teammates, and just adjusting to campus and whatnot? Oh, it's been a pretty good adjustment. Uh, gelling with the guys pretty well. Uh, it really has been a good adjustment for me, really more than I expected. So the guys brought me in. So um, me, me adjusting everything well, so it's been going, going good. Go to Michael and then Shannon. Hey, Sydney, Michael McCann, a Cardinal Authority. Um, I've talked to Malik at, at Louisville Live, and he's mentioned it before that you guys have a relationship, obviously, you know, from the same area. What's, yeah. from your vantage point, what's the, what's the connection with you two? Like, what's that bond like? Oh, uh, it's, it's, it's a real tight bond. Really, that's, that's my step cousin, so really got a, a good bond. Uh, we played against each other in high school. I've uh, been working out with each other, and uh, he really was a big a big impact when we come to Louisville, so really, really uh, a good close friend and family member. Shannon? Hey, Sydney. Shannon Russell from the Courier Journal. Um, since you've come to Louisville, uh, since you arrived in July, what work have you done physically on your body with Coach Kettler, and um, have you lost weight at all since you've yeah. been here? Uh, yeah, I lost um, – 22 pounds, so, I, so I've been getting a pretty decent shape with Coach Cat, uh, working every day, uh, conditioning in the morning, afternoons and stuff, so really getting prepared for the season. So Coach Coach Cat been a big help. And if I could follow that up, what do you do, what did you do to lose the weight? Was it changing your diet? Was it um, was it weight training? Was it you know physical activity? All of it? Oh uh, yeah, it was more of a weight training and um, with my diet, just listening to what I'm eating, taking control of my calorie deficit and stuff like that. So. Really a combined of both. Russ Brown? Yeah, Sydney, I wanted to follow up on uh, the question about Malik Williams. How did those matchups go? You're younger than him, obviously, but i do not yeah. not quite sure how much. But um, how those matchups go and, you know, what was it like playing against him then and any particular part of your game that you think is similar to his? Uh, we both rebound the ball. I run the floor. Uh, when I play him, he, he, he can shoot a little bit more better than me, but um, i probably say our physicality, rebounding the ball, so. How, how did the matchup go when you played him? I only played I only played him probably one time, so the matches were pretty good. We went back and forth with each other, so it was a pretty good game. Okay. To Michael. Hey, Sydney, now, now that team practice is underway, what's that first day of pre team practice like? I mean, the high energy? I mean, what's what's it like? Obviously, it's different than individuals. So what's, yeah. it, what's it like for you guys? Uh, well, we're we going to start our first practice today. So we didn't get a whiff of what, what's that going to be like. Uh, really high energy, uh, a lot of the drills and stuff. Just getting ready for the season and stuff. So really high intensity stuff, full court. Uh, really focusing on defense this year. So. Shannon? After you reopened your commitment, what was it about Louisville that that brought you here? Um, I, I knew Coach Mack since he was at Xavier, so I obviously had a connection with Coach Mack. Um, and really, it's been closer to home, so my family comes to some of my games, more of my games, so only three hours away. So it was, it was convenient for my family, too. So, um, And I felt like it was a, a, a good fit for me uh, for my game. And uh, I, I trust Co Coach Mack with, um, with my games, so. I like the team, the teammates, everybody here has brought me in. So that's really a really a good feel I had on my visit. So. Matt? Hey, Sydney, Matt again. Uh, you talked a little bit about your matchups with Malik, but when you th uh, throw in uh, Gabe and other guys who can play the one in, how do you feel uh, about this team's uh, ability in the front court so far? I feel like we have a, a good ability to uh, rebound the ball, uh, score, pass out double teams. Uh, we're getting better on the defensive end, but – I feel like overall, we got a we got a pretty decent front front court this year. Uh, a lot of depth with Rose, uh, Gabe, Malik, and myself. So I feel like we uh, we're in a pretty good spot right now. We got to keep working. Other questions for Sydney? Well, I guess I'll go ahead and interject. Um, I know a lot of talk over this offseason is about the offseason, but how are things looking on the defensive end so far? in workouts and just drills and, and things of that nature? Uh, things are really, really, looking, really looking good on the defensive end. Obviously, we focus on offense, but more the, more the last month and a half, we've been focusing on defense and stuff, so that's really picking up. 
uh, making, that, making that an emphasis in practice. So that's really been a, a main focus with Coach Mack trying to install on us. Michael. Hey, Sydney. Obviously, you weren't here last year, but uh, a couple new assistants on the staff. Um, how would you describe, you know, what Ross, uh, Coach Ross McMains is is bringing to this program and how it's impacting practice and style of play? Uh, coach, coach Ross is a good coach, uh, bringing a new offensive style to our team. Um, we play more faster, more intensity. So C Coach Ross has brought, brought a new, a new um, offense to us that we really like, and we're just going with it. So. To Russ? Yeah, Sydney, how can you just talk a little bit about how you think you fit in with this group uh, being one of the newcomers? What do you think you're going to contribute? Well, I contribute rebounding, uh, scoring in the post, um, being, being a, um, a defender. Really, really just been a high energy guy coming and rebounding the ball, just being, being there for my teammates whenever they need me. So I feel like I do a, a good job of trying to be a leader on the team. Um, just, just being a high energy guy on the team. So. Matt? Hey, Sydney, Matt again. For those who haven't had a, uh, a chance to, to watch you play, how would you describe your style of play and who do you maybe model your game after? Uh, I have a high energy motor. Um, I like to dunk the ball, just to, just a high energy player. Um, I really want to model my game after anybody, but I'd probably say just a high energy guy that plays both ends of the floor. Uh, doing anything for the team to win, so. Right, anything further? Uh, go to Shannon. Hey, Sydney, how do you think your time at junior college affected you, whether it was like from a personal standpoint or a basketball standpoint? Uh, going to junior college, it made me, made me uh, grow up and mature a little bit more. Um, also, me me developing uh, my game overall, uh, spending more time in the gym. Uh, really had a, really had a good staff at Johnny Logan and Coach Smith Peters and stuff. So, um, and John Clancy they really helped me expand my game a little bit more than, than what I had in high school. So, like that that was a good point for me going to junior college and really really mature. And what parts of your game did you think you improved? Uh, parts of my free throw shooting, just me being able to run the floor a little bit more, um, being more agile. Uh, just me being more smart, smarter, thinking thinking about the game. So I, I, I think uh, a lot more about the game now since I went to junior college. Any last questions? All right. Well, thank you for joining us, Sydney. Have a great thank first you. day of practice.